What we're looking at here is another piece of software that comes in Amplitube's Fender Studio Bundle. This is called Sonoma Wireworks Riffworks T4. Riffworks T4 is an easy to use recording program that includes automatic track creation, loop recording, guitar oriented effects, instant drummer, professionally recorded drum tracks, RiffLink online collaboration, and RiffCaster instant song posting at riffworld.com. <gasps> what does all that mean? Well, Riffworks T4 has a lot of features and you can go to sonomawireworks.com to check them all out. What I'm gonna do is just walk you through the main essence of this program and that is to get your ideas recorded with just a few clicks so that you can create structure and produce your songs let's get started now the first thing i want to do is i want to set up a guitar tone to use so i'm going to come down here to effects and you get a lot of options here i'm going to focus over here on amp if you click on this black arrow any software that you have on your computer that will be able to produce a sound inside of Riffworks T4 will be listed. I'm gonna use Amplitude's Fender SE because that's what came with my Fender Studio bundle. And I'm gonna click on that. And there is my Fender SE. Now I've created a preset inside of my uh, 65 Twin Reverb folder here. Just to get a little bit of sound, let's see what this sounds like. Sounds cool. So I've got my guitar tone set up, simple as that. Next thing I wanna do is I wanna create a beat, something to play over. So I'm gonna come up here to drummer and inside a session here, we've got our choices for what we can choose. And I happen to go through this earlier and I like this one. And uh, it comes up first with verse. And if you wanna audition what that's gonna sound like, come over here and hit play. Sounds good. And I've got things set to go for a length of eight bars. So you can see those eight bars happening up here. That means I'm gonna record over all eight of these bars before it repeats itself. So I've got my guitar tone, I've got my drums set up. Now we just need to start recording some ideas. So come over here to your layers button and it's blank. Obviously we haven't recorded anything yet. So I'm gonna name this riff idea here. Uh, this will be verse idea. And like I said, it's a length of eight bars. So when I click this record button, we're gonna hear a click track count in, and then I'm gonna start recording. Over each eight bars, it's gonna give me a layer. When it goes back to one, it's gonna give me another layer. And you can just keep layering on top of layer as much as you wanna do. What I'm gonna do right now is record two layers. I've got two ideas in mind. So I'm just gonna hit record and let it go over the eight bars twice. And I'm gonna stop that. So I let it go around the eight bars twice. So I've got layer one and layer two. Now I wanna lay down an idea that I've got for a chorus. So I'm gonna come up here to create, to create a new riff. I'm gonna name this riff chorus idea. And I'm gonna do the same procedure. I'm gonna come down to effects and select a different uh, sound for my guitar. I've created a preset down here in the supersonic folder. So I've got my different guitar tone now for this different part. I'm gonna come up here to drummer, select a different drum part. Let's go with chorus. And now I'm gonna go uh, hide my effects. And now I'm here at layers. And now I'm ready to record my chorus ideas. So it's the same procedure. I'm gonna click this and record a couple of ideas.
right, I got my chorus idea that has two layers. I've got my verse idea that has two layers. Now I've got the ideas that I had in my head down in Riffworks very simply. Now I want to start to structure these things to hear how I can start to build this song. Well, up here in the song timeline, it says drag riffs here to build a song. So let's do that. Let's take the verse idea, drag it up there. We'll take the chorus idea, drag it over here, and maybe add another verse idea over here. We'll see how that sounds. Over here, you just hit the play button to listen back. So there you go. I had a couple ideas in my head and with a few clicks, I've got them laid out in a verse idea, a chorus idea, and then up here in the song timeline, I can start to structure and rearrange and really hear how I can produce my song. Very powerful and simple piece of software. Riffworks T4 by Sonoma Wireworks. Again, you can go to sonomawireworks.com to learn all the features behind this program. And you can go to IK Multimedia to learn more about the Amplitude line of products.